Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi has wrapped up his Dhaka visit. The Prime Minister was in the country to celebrate the Golden Jubilee of Bangladesh's independence and the birth centenary of Bangladesh's father of the nation, Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. It was a packed two days for the Prime Minister during his visit. He started the day with a trip to the Jeshureshwari Temple. This is situated around 300 kilometers from the capital, Dhaka. The Indian government will be constructing a multi-purpose community hall at the temple. This visit to a Hindu temple is a first of its kind by a head of state. He then paid a visit to the mausoleum of Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman. He was received there by the Bangladesh Prime Minister and late Bangabandhu's second daughter. Prime Minister Modi is the first Indian dignitary to ever visit the place. He also signed the visitor's book at the mausoleum complex. His next stop was at the Orakandi Temple to offer prayers. The temple is sacred to the Matua community of West Bengal. It is considered to be the place of birth of the Matua Gurus and holds immense significance. This stop is being hailed as a strengthening point in the Delhi-Dhaka relationship. This temple is the abode of hundreds of members of the Hindu Matua community, a large number of whom are residents of West Bengal. The Prime Minister also met with members of the Matua community living in Bangladesh. In the same gathering, he called for bolstering ties and presenting a united front in the face of instability and terror. Bharat and Bangladesh, both of them, are the same as the people who are in the world. Both of them, are the same as the people अस्थिरता, आतंक और अशांति की जगह स्थिरता, प्रेम और शांति चाहते हैं। Alongside participating in the centenary celebrations, Prime Minister Modi held crucial bilateral consultations with his Bangladesh counterpart. Key agreements have been inked. Prime Minister Modi also met the Bangladesh President Abdul Hamid. And as the Prime Minister concluded his two-day visit, officials say the India-Bangladesh partnership has reached a new high. The Prime Minister took to Twitter as well, thanking the people of Bangladesh for their sincerity and said that the crucial visit will further strengthen bilateral ties between the two sides. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.